There's a lot of YouTube channels that do these Kinder Egg unboxings. Well, they're not unboxings, but they, you know, they do these surprise eggs. These aren't really available in the USA. So when I seen them at a swap meet, I thought I got to check them out. They only had two types, so I thought I would get the two of each. I got two SpongeBob's. And then they had a, uh, uh-oh. I think these were animal ones. I think they told me that these were animals. One of them didn't survive me walking around a couple hours with them in the bag. I'll have to dump the chocolate for the other one. But these here, I'm going to save the chocolate from these. I'm curious how it tastes. And I'm not particularly fond of milk chocolate. Sometimes it upsets my stomach. Uh, I love dark chocolate. I eat a lot of cho dark chocolate. Oh yeah, sometimes, yeah, 50 years old, and uh, milk chocolate gives me pimples. Yeah, let's see. That was easy. I see the line here where they uh, form the two. There's two. I forgot, this one was uh, SpongeBob, had orange. Here's a, is this animal? I think this is the animal one. I assume it's going to have a yellow. I'm sure a lot of you guys in uh, countries not in the USA, I'm sure you guys are really familiar with these. I'm going to go ahead and take a bite of one. Check it out while I'm um, starting to be rude eating in front of you. I guess this one will be orange. Yep, orange. I'll eat those later. Kind of sweet. Pretty sweet. Uh, I'll ask the kids if they want that one. What do we got? Some little uh, cricket? <laughs> Maybe some Martian cricket. I'll zoom in. I'll zoom in on him later. Instead of animals, maybe they're bugs. Snail. Escargo. Spongebob. Square pants. Oh, it's a puzzle. And let's see what's here. Oh, another puzzle. This one looks like animals. Hey, it's in Spanish. Instead of Spongebob square pants, they call it Bob Esponja. In Spanish, the J's pronounced like an H. I know that much. And look, I got the first two guys on the left, but I didn't get any of the uh, characters. I wonder if there's a way to tell on the outside what you're going to get in the package. Because uh, it would seem like uh, I should have been able to get at least one of these guys. Odds aren't too good to get the uh, two you know, lesser known characters. On the back of each one, they happen to have the uh, corresponding picture or poster for the character. These things are pretty nicely detailed. They're not little cheapy toys. They look really good. I think I paid $2 each for the eggs. And you guys, uh, and you guys like this stuff? You like uh, the chocolate or the toys? If you do, what kind, of, what kind of toys do you like to get? I think I'll have just another piece. Here's the insert for the other two. Looks like we got a mama monkey and a baby monkey. Mama lion, baby lion. Mama koala, baby koala. Uh, mama zebra, baby zebra. It looks like our puzzles are going to be the lions and the zebras. Halfway done. I start with the outside because it's easier. You have the uh, flat line on the outside. But puzzle making is hard work. I think I'll just have just one more. This zebra is kind of funny. He's got two legs and a head. But, oh, never mind. Wrong spot. Sorry. Let's put him over here. Ta-da! That was easy enough. Nice little puzzle. 
What should I get as a reward? Okay, just one more. Halfway with the lions. Time for a break. Just, just one more piece. Ta -da! All done. Mm -mm. That means I can finish the last one too. These things are pretty neat. Affordable. Get a little toy. Get yourself some chocolate. I got puzzles. I got little figures. Hmm. Mm -mm. Uh oh. Maybe too much chocolate for me. Mi estomago no bueno. Uh, no good. Adios. Bye-bye.